freed. Uh, see, when the, the the grain was threshed, it was winnowed by uh, being thrown up against the wind. <laughs> Afterwards, tossed with wooden scoops. Uh, Isaiah thirty twenty four. Mm -hmm. The shovel and the fan for winnowing are mentioned in Psalm uh, thirty five. Job, Hosea. Mm -hmm. The refuse of the straw and chaff were burned up. Mm -hmm. Freed from impurities, the grain was then laid up in granaries till used. Yes. Mm. Matthew 6.26. Oh. <laughs> now let's see here. Matthew 6.26. Mm -hmm. uh, starting in chapter 6. Take heed that ye do not your alms before men oh, to be seen of them. Otherwise you have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. <laughs> Therefore, when thou doest thine alms... <laughs> Do not sound a trumpet before thee, as the hypocrites do in the synagogues, <laughs> and in the streets, that they may have glory of men. <laughs> Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. Yes. Mm -hmm. But when thou doest alms, let not thy left hand know what thy right hand doeth, huh? that thine alms may be in secret, and thy father which seeth in secret himself shall reward thee openly. <laughs> Now, this idea of the secret giving of those that are men that don't want the reward from men, poop. You know, um, I had thought, yes, that an eye was seeing what was being given into every offering plate, yes, into every bucket, poo. Somebody had to know the giving of those that are Christians. I had this experience on Guam where I thought there was an eye, uh-huh, that had to see everything that people were doing. And as much as I can't see through your eyes, yes. Let's say that you did see what I was giving. Yes. Mm -hmm. Not only does it violate my uh, right to uh, not have you know. Yes. In many ways, it violates my right to receive a reward from God instead of men. Poop. Now, yesterday I mentioned the giving of certain denominations. Yes. See, let's let's look at it for just a second. Let's say you're in a, a Christian denomination that has to know how much you gave as a percentage of your actual taxable income. And if an inordinate number of persons in that denomination have all given exactly 15% of what they've earned, yes, there is the unnecessary amount of influence of the denomination on the giving of those that are members. Yes. Now, there's this uh, top secret way of giving to God where you can't know what I give so that my reward would be from, from God himself. Yes. Now, this idea of being on each other, sowing in, yes, there's a possibility. There's two definitions of sowing. Mm -hmm. There's sowing in to be on those so you can see what they give. Yes, that violates the right, yes, to give in secret so that your reward, which is in heaven right now. Mm -hmm. Then there's wrapping. <laughs> A lot of giants, they wrap themselves. It's kind of like the use of gravity, yes, to wrap your muscles so that you appear smaller than you actually are. <clears throat> now, I'd heard of somebody that's been in the Congress of the United States that's six foot eight. Yes, I did want you to unsew yourself uh -huh, mm -hmm. so that you cannot be on the citizens so that they can give in secret. Yes. And that with that secret, their father, which seeth in secret himself, shall reward thee openly. Openly, yeah. See, God wants to wants to do something in my personal life. Yes, but He doesn't want me to know what He's going to do until He does it. Yes, and then everybody can see what God has done as a reward for myself for giving. Yes, I don't have to tell anybody what. I'm doing. <laughs> then there's a giant way. <laughs> Where you mm -hmm, wrap yourself, yes, quite possibly electricity, West Virginia, poop. <laughs> now, I know I sounded mean yesterday in the video, yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I don't like giants that refuse to unwrap themselves so that I don't know their actual height. Yes, yes, yes. I want to know your full size, and I never want you to wrap your muscles, poop. I don't want you to sew into the electric grid, yeah. <laughs> 
Mm -hmm. I don't want you to magnetize yourself. Yes, I want to know the actual height and size of every man in the United States that is inordinately strong. Yes, because, you know, let's say you're, you, you say you're six foot eight, but you unwrap your muscles because you unsew the electric grid from yourself. Yes, giants have a propensity to use the magnetism. Yes, of different geographic locations throughout the earth right now. Mm -hmm. And then they kind of try to hide their identity. Yes, by keeping their muscles wrapped tight using the electric grid. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden they get upset and they're, they're six inches taller than they actually said they were. Pow! <laughs> Now, these giants in the land, yes, they did. Mm -hmm. A long time ago in the book of Genesis, do you want to talk about the sons of God? Ouch! You know, there was a flood that took place because a lot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They like to have their way with women. Pooch. You know, the use of technology to say, well, my goodness, you are quite the honey buggy. You know, I do not like women being used uh -huh, for your sexual gratification because you said, well, I only use this purse to make money. Boo! And I don't like it when you use their wombs without their knowledge corporate way. Yes. Now, my thought is, okay is a large number of giants realize that if they actually uh, conceived and allowed for the giving birth of their actual genetics, they'd be legally liable for child support. <laughs> and then each of their offspring would have a legal claim on their estates. <laughs> well, the giants had this great idea. <laughs> Why don't we do it this way, corporate white? Right now! <laughs> what we'll do is, yes, we'll set it up so that this pretty little thing, yes, falls in love what looks like the man of her life Boo, dog and then we'll just put our sperm in there and then we'll have them have sex together yes and the little baby that's born is not their actual genetics oh because giants will use any vagina they can get a hold of now my thought is poop each and every one. Oh, oh my gosh that's right you giant piece of shit right now I want you to unwrap your muscles so that I can see your actual size and shape. I want you to unsew the electric grid out of your fucking ass right now because...